welcome to vlogmas day 10 how are you all doing so today's video is dedicated to the beauty room like i mentioned yesterday i've literally just finished editing my vlogmas day nine which is scheduled to go live at four i think yeah four o'clock but it would already be up by now so go and watch it out if you haven't already it's all in order but yeah go and catch up if you haven't already can you hear the seagulls <laughs> today is a day dedicated to the beauty room so you would have seen last night i should really shut my window you would have seen last night that we had a nice family sunday and then when we came home at around half nine brady was playing fifa and i was like you know what i'm just gonna clean the rest of the flat apart from the beauty room so then tomorrow i can wake up and i can just do the room so that's the plan i've already done that the window um yeah so everything is all tidy apart from the beauty room so we're gonna tidy that today and i'm so excited for it to all be done then we'll get ready together and then i think i'm gonna wrap some more presents and stuff it all depends on time and then i need to go to the shop it's just a very busy day so yeah exciting <laughs> So before I jump into this video, I thought I would share with you guys my beautiful watch and cuff from Daniel Wellington. You guys know how obsessed I am with this. I have been showing you guys this a lot recently, but I do feel like over the festive period, it is a perfect gift for any member in your family and it just goes with every single outfit. I dress them up and down and I wear them every single day. I literally just love them so much. Oh, didn't mean to zoom. I always have them here by my bedside table. So then in the morning, I can just get up and put them on and I'm good to go. They have so many different colors as well. And I have a code which will get you 15% off in store and online so you can get the whole 15 percent off this whole set or separately it's up to you but they have so many different colors and it's just such a nice bracelet and watch you guys know how much i love this and i wear it every single day so yay no of course but what i'm going to do before i begin with my day is write a to-do list because then i know exactly what i need to do it's a good feeling when you also tick it off and it's good to be as productive as possible so I like to like try and fit in as much as I can because then I feel like I've done a lot and yes yeah, so I'm just going to write my to-do list out and then go from there. what it looks like before so we've got all of this here it's just a lot of it is gift guide and a lot of it is clothes i've been sent and things like that which is amazing but i just had because it's been absolutely manic here i've had no time to like do it so i think now it's about the right time for me to just be like you know what i need to do this now <laughs> it's too much man
have a bit of an addiction to pyjamas. Like, I don't know if this is normal. So I'm really sorting them out. I have a dedicated drawer to Christmas pyjamas. I don't know if I'm alright. But um, I'm sorting them all out and I'm going to give a massive bin bag to my sister-in-law, Libby. Uh, Bradley's sister because... I really need to be strict and I don't need all of these so yeah I'm gonna give her all of my old pajamas because um, she said that she wants them and I clearly don't need them it's a bit of a joke this but we're gonna try and sort this out into two drawers don't know how this is gonna go down but we will see makeup now because ah, I need to um film a video for well my gift guide video which I'm so excited about all the stuff's here and it's been here for a couple of weeks now so I'm just like oh um but I wanted to mention these brushes that I use are actually in the gift guide let me show you so I use the vanity planet brushes they look like this when you open them up. As you can see, mine are dirty because I use them all the time. So I contacted them and I was like, please, can you send me new ones? Because I don't want to show you guys like presents to buy and they look all messy. Um, so yeah, I'm currently using their foundation. What's it called? Flat top stippling brush. I use this to blend in my foundation and it works so well. So I'm just using this. But um, what I was going to say, obviously it's in my gift guide video, it, I just think it's such a good present. I have a 70% off code, which is unreal, perfect for Christmas, so definitely get buying now because you need to use the code and you get 70% off and it's perfect, such a good present. I feel like you can never have too many brushes, I constantly get brushes and I'm just like, yep, yeah, I just love getting brushes. Anyone else? I don't know, but um, it comes in this beautiful case. It's perfect to travel around with. There are 15, but I think, oh yeah, I have got all of them. Um, but they're just perfect for a base makeup, just for like essentials. So yes, I will leave, oh, I'll leave the code and everything like that in the description box down below for you guys, because they are so good. Also, if you're wondering where this, it's a onesie, I'll link it for you guys down below. So you can check it out. It's just such a cosy onesie. I love it so much. Um, but yes, this brush is so good. And then they also have this brush. It's small. And I use this to blend the foundation on my neck. It works so well. I'm going to add a little bit more foundation. I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible in the shade Sand. Um, it just works really well for my skin colour at the moment. They sent me quite a few, which was so lovely of them. So it's good because I can just range and change but if you have a foundation which is a bit too dark because I know in the winter my skin anyway gets a lot more paler and it's so annoying if you mix it with moisturizer it will dilute it a bit and change the color a bit more paler so that's a little tip for you guys if you did want to make your foundation a bit lighter but not buy a brand new one because I know it's annoying when You've got to buy a brand new one for your skin tone but your skin tone keeps changing and you're like what <laughs> so yeah my little tip for you guys for concealer i've been using the maybelline fit me one for so long now and it's just my favorite it works so well for my skin so um i really like it i feel like the coverage is really good and it's so cheap so ch like it's not like couple of pounds i think it's around four or five pounds but every time i go into asda it's on offer for like four pounds so check there before you go to super or something because i always find that it's on offer there um but i'll try and leave a link for all the makeup and stuff that i use in the description box down below for you guys sorry my telly's on in the other room it's so loud <laughs> for powder i am going to use my favorite hello flawless you guys know how much i love this if you've watched my videos before but if you haven't then this is what I use. And I use their Hoola Bronzer 
brush with it um, I just feel like it works really well and it spreads because it's, it's quite a thick brush and when you push on your face as you can see it just spreads really evenly so I just like how this goes on my face um, because of how big the brushes are but I also if I want more of a compact if I'm going out I'll use the powder slash blush brush because it's a bit smaller but it's a lot more dense so you're going to pack the product on a bit more and you're going to put a little bit more product on your face um, but both of them work really well this just puts a little bit more product on because of how dense it is and it's a lot smaller whereas this one the brussels are really soft but like quite flimsy if that makes sense so for an everyday use this is the brush I like to use just because it's quite quick and easy just to go boop, boop, boop. <laughs> whereas when I want more of a dramatic night outlook and I want more product on my face I'll use the other brush but I just love this powder so much honestly if you don't have it I'll leave it linked in the description box down below so you guys can check the price out and all of that kind of stuff but it's honestly like the best thing ever <laughs> I love it so much for contour and blush I always like to use this it's called benefit pretty in the USA looks like this I use the hula bronzer you could just buy the hula bronzer on its own um, and I've actually got it on its own but when we went on the trip with them I got this and it's just so good because it's really compact fits perfectly in your makeup bag oh and you've got your contour blush and highlighter in one the highlighter is quite natural um, but I'll try it today but I'm just obsessed with the Anastasia one so it's hard for me to change but um yeah I'll try it for you guys today just so you can see what it looks like I feel like it's quite hard for me to change my makeup routine because I'm so used to doing it in a certain way and my skin just agrees with a lot of products that I never really change and whenever I film videos people are like you always use the same products and I'm like I know but like when you find something that works well for you wouldn't you just stick to it although I know I should try different ones maybe I'll do a video soon trying all new makeup would you like that like like nothing the same even my brows maybe not my brows that's saying a lot <laughs> but yeah but I like quite a bronzed look because the only thing I say about the hula bronzer is I don't know if it's just me but I feel like it sort of blends in with your foundation which is so good but then the colour fades a little bit so I always add a little bit more and then throughout the day it sort of comes off and then it's the colour that I want I don't know if I'm just thinking that but <laughs> that's what it feels like anyway so that's what I've been doing I like to do my eyes and then move on to blush and stuff because if anything falls I just feel like it tops it off at the end I don't know am I like to fall? so this is my favourite palette I think I've ever owned it's amazing i need to oh, get a new one because i'm so like denting all the colors in that i'm having to stop using the shimmers because of how much it's dent and i know i'm going to regret it like because i use it every day so i need to stop ah i've dropped a brush so i'm going to use the shade bare to begin with just to cover my lid and i use the actual huda beauty for that shade because it just works well for me the only thing the vanity planet brush that doesn't have is a really big fluffy eyeshadow brush blending brush because I like to use one that's really fluffy and really big this is the biggest one I have I suppose you could get it fluffy but I like to use this one for more of like a dense in my crease direct and then blend it out whereas this I like to use just to blend it I think it's from BH I'm gonna use the shade secret this is sort of the go-to look I've been using with this palette and I just literally pop it on my lid and it's such an easy look to do um, this brush blends everything so nicely look it's not hard to do at all anyone could do this so easy and blendable do the same on the other eye brush and use the shades tease raw and tickle mix all three of them together I love to mix colors I feel like it's so hard for me just to use one I have to mix and go from the outer V. I don't know what look, what look, what look I'm gonna do. I don't know if I should like a hollow eye. Maybe I'll do that. So I'm gonna use some colour here in the middle. Okay, there's a bit of fallout, guys. <laughs> Get a brush and just quickly wipe it. There we go. Oh, I look great. <laughs> yeah. So just get your colour here, here, and then a little bit on the top. And then you're leaving that middle bit and then sort of blend it but not fully because you can use your blending brush for that 
it should look like you've been punched in the eye at this point but we work with it when you blend it out it'll be all right so something like that get the medium blender put the shade secret on it and then blend it up so at this point when i've done both i'm going to wipe any excess off under my eye it normally just comes off and it doesn't stay on your face as long as you have enough powder on obviously underneath i'm gonna mix i love to mix all three of these colors together like that so the color crave fantasy and daydream i just love mixing it just i don't know and then just pop in your middle like this like a line I feel like using your finger for sparkly colours and shimmers is so much more pigmented. Okay, so I accidentally put highlighter on. I didn't show you guys. <laughs> I literally just use the Anastasia one because I want to film and stuff and it glow. I'm just going to keep that on. For lashes, I'm using... They're not in here because they're in my eyes. I'm using the Backstage Lashes in the Star Melrose Avenue. These are my favourite lashes ever. Sorry, that was really up and personal. I love them so much. I've also got a code for these as well, which is ideal for Christmas. You can be like one for me, one for you. And yeah, I feel like these are just so nice. I love them so much. They're literally my favourite lashes. That's all I've got to say. And then I'm going to now do my lips. I use the Nivea Original Care Lip Balm. I like to use any lip balm, but not like a pot of Vaseline because... I feel like it's so much quicker and easy to use like a rolly up one. I don't know what the correct term is, <laughs> but I just find it easy, especially when it's in my makeup bag. And I just feel like in the um, winter, my lips get so chapped and it's so horrible. Ugh! Right, I need to sharpen my lip liner. So I'm gonna sharpen that. Oh, right, I'm using the Rimmel Cappuccino lip liner because really, what else do I use? <laughs> For lips, I'm using the MAC collab with Jamie Genevieve. It's my perfect nude. If I could get about 100 of these for Christmas, I'd be so happy. But apparently, you can only buy it in Selfridges. So Bradley bought me this one, and it's like going already. It's so sad. I'm like, Ugh. so yeah, this is my favorite lipstick. I'll leave a link to it in the description box down below. So if you did want to get it, then I'll leave a link there, but it's my favourite colour, and I think it's limited edition, so I'm so scared it's going to run out. I'm like, no. Um, but yeah, I am going to do my hair now. I'm not going to do it on camera because it just takes forever. And also, I'm going to do a video on it as well, so I'll show you guys how I do it. But I'm going to do my hair, and then I will be back. I don't know what this was. <laughs> okay, so I've just finished filming my gift guide video, which will probably be up after this video. Like the day after so I like to upload in the morning because I upload my vlogs every night so when I do like a proper sit down video it'll be up tomorrow morning for you guys so that's all exciting I had so many things so definitely go and check that out tomorrow at nine o'clock if I edit in time I probably will I'm gonna edit now actually um so yeah I'm gonna go and eat something I'm still loving my watch and yeah just wrap some presents I think and eat and edit and all of that kind of stuff so yeah i'm still loving my hair by the way i've had so many questions like what do you think of the um tapes and things like that honestly honestly i absolutely love them i'm so i got used to them in a couple of days i love them they don't hurt my head at all you have to use sulfate free shampoo and conditioner that's the only thing like change you have uh, my hair lasts. I haven't washed my hair in about four or five days. It just lasts. I put dry shampoo in it and my roots. It's not greasy. But the curls really do stay there. And I feel like I can put it up in a bun and all of that kind of stuff. And it just stays. So it's ideal. Also, can we take a moment to appreciate my tidy filming room slash beauty room? I'm going to um, do before and after as well and show you guys that now. I just had to do a little sit down video and do my makeup and stuff because I was not looking good. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll leave all the products that I used for my makeup in the description box down below. So I'm gonna go and wrap presents up now because a lot of them are Bradley's, which I've shown in this video and he can't know about them or see them. So I'm gonna to have to 
go and wrap them up now before he gets home and yeah yes 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 also this lip gloss it's a new one i show you guys in my video you'll see tomorrow in a gift guide i'll show you guys what it is it's quite nice hmm. anyway i need to stop now so these lights can go off oh my god look how much of a difference that light makes it's crazy absolutely crazy so anyway i'm gonna go and wrap okay so i wanted to am i zoomed in no i'm just really close i wanted to show you guys my after of my filming room i had to quickly film a video because i was like oh my god i need to i need to do it before, before i can't talk i need to do it before bradley gets home because i need to then wrap some of his presents up so i was like i'll show you guys after but anyway this is what it looks like now how much of a difference has that made so this is what it looks like the furniture is amazing i need to put these bags in there but it's a lot of effort because that's in the way this is my onesie it's from misguided i'll link it for you guys down below absolutely obsessed and then this is what the rest of it looks like how cute i love it so much so in the drawers i've tried to organize it this is like my stationery drawer this one's bradley's stuff that needs a clean it's not really like i need to put the compartments in here for his stuff to go in and then the other two are like underwear drawers but yeah i want to like sort this out as well i love how this covers i felt like because of the window also how nice is my chair oh, i'm obsessed um oh so cozy but yeah because of my window it's quite i have quite a lot of like pricey things in here such as this and when the lights on i feel like everyone could see outside so i kind of like the way that it's covered and also i hate my windows because i've got the crosses in because this is such an old build flat so i kind of like how it's all i don't know i can still open the window if i want to but it's kind of like separate and i like that so yeah i've now got this as well as my desk because i didn't have a prop one before that i could sit under so I've got my desk. I need to charge these two up so I can start editing on here because I feel it'll be so much quicker. Um, and then I've put all my makeup and stuff in there. But yes, it feels so nice for it to all be clean. However, my room, it's not even my room. I've got clothes. You'd have seen there was like two massive boxes. I managed to put all of the clothes into one. But tomorrow's job is to sort out my wardrobe. Oh my God, I'm so like, ugh. It's a job that I just don't want to do, but I've got to do it. Um, but yeah, can we take a moment to appreciate my chair? How nice is this? It was actually meant to go in my dining room, but let's turn you off. I don't know if you can see, it didn't fit over there. So we were like, actually, suits me i'll put it in my um, filming room Bradley was like okay um but yeah i got a package i want to show you that now because i think it's christmasy stuff and i'm so excited so i've just got a package from the interior collection how luxury is this this is what their instagram and stuff is so definitely go and follow them they've sent me some christmas stuff look how cute this first one is it's a little ornament for my tree it's glass I'm so surprised it hasn't smashed. It's so dainty and beautiful. So I need to hang this up somewhere. It needs to like have its spotlight. How beautiful is that? This can be moved that way. That is stunning. Let me see what else I got. oh my god guys these are marble coasters look how stunning these are how beautiful this four in there oh my god braddy's gonna absolutely adore these these are lovely i'm gonna pop these here because we have all our drinks and stuff there but oh my god thank you so so much to interior collection yeah that's their name for sending those bits it's so amazing i'm so obsessed with all of your pieces 
They're so beautiful and dainty, so thank you so much. Oh, I love it. Okay, so I've just finished taking pictures for Instagram. And now, I just can't go over the lighting difference, look without it it's mental i'm gonna finish wrapping presents now i want to try and do all of them by today and then i can just the more presents i get in the future i can just wrap them on the day if that makes sense because i don't want to leave it to the last minute and it will get hectic so i want to like try and do it as i go um so yeah, i'm gonna put love actually on watch that and what are you doing lottie lottie what are you doing what are you doing um and yeah i'm also having cheese and crackers <laughs> I have no like proper lunch food in and all I have is cheese and crackers so I'm like okay and then um Bradley's gonna come and then he was meant to come an hour early but he's got to go back to his office and then he's gonna come back so yeah and then I don't know what we're doing for dinner yet but hmm I'm gonna tell him he can cook <laughs> because I've done it the last time so it's his turn um yeah and then we're just gonna relax tonight and then chill and yeah quite exciting <laughs> Not really exciting, but you know what I mean. I can't go over the difference in here. I'm so happy with the after of the room. It's so good. Bradley's made us dinner. We can't eat at the table because there's too many presents underneath. Come we? Hello everyone. I haven't said hello today. No, you haven't. Oh. Say hello. Hello. Just you, sir. I'm still editing. It's half ten now. I've just finished editing my gift guide part one video which is really exciting. I don't know if it's gonna go up before or after this video, it just depends on the timing and stuff. Um, and, oh, Lottie's yawning. Um, and then, yeah, I'm just trying to edit this video that I'm filming now, and yeah, it's all exciting. <laughs> so I'm literally just gonna finish editing this video and then, oh God, and then I'm gonna go and have a shower. I was gonna have a bath, but I feel like it's getting too late now and, I need to wash my hair and it's just effort because I have to wash it and then blow dry it and then yeah it's not good because I have the tape extensions it takes a bit longer than usual to dry my hair I would usually just leave it overnight but it's still quite damp and it's not good in this weather when you have damp hair because it could get you really ill so I like to blow dry it just before I go to bed and then I'll style and stuff in the morning but thank you so much for watching this video I hope you have enjoyed vlogmas day 10 I am so happy with my beauty room and how it's turned out I feel like it's just my dream it's everything that I wanted I do have some touches that I need to do I'm not sure if I'm 100% about the rug yet I don't know if it's too big or the colours too much because online it did look a bit different but the quality of it is perfect it's just I feel like I didn't really do my measurements right <laughs> so it's really big but I suppose no makeup will get on the actual carpet and it will get on the uh, rug instead so that's a bonus but um yeah I'm really really happy with that done loads of presents done most of my work that I needed to do and tomorrow we've got to do this I've also got a meeting tomorrow with my management at 12 so I'll bring you guys along with me then as well um we can go to my management we do Lottie um what else am I doing? 
I've just got videos to film, like content. I've got other videos to film. I want to do my gift guide part two. I've got to sort my wardrobe out. And I know it's going to take me so long. Um, but yeah, you'll see what I do tomorrow anyway. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you have. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram page, which is just Walker. Give me a little DM and let me know you guys have been watching my vlogmas. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Say bye. Say bye, Luzi. Say bye. Yeah? Can you say bye? <laughs>